If you have asthma and this is the inhaler you keep reaching for, albuterol, you're doing it wrong and here's why. To understand this, we need to first understand what asthma actually is. See, asthma isn't just about being short of breath or wheezing. It's a disease of inflammation inside the air passageways. And what does that mean? Think of eczema of the skin when your skin gets red or irritable and, and intensely itchy. Now imagine that same inflammation happening on the inside skin, the inside lining of those tiny air passageways in the lungs called bronchioles. That is what asthma is and it is that itch that causes the chronic cough. But it doesn't just stop there. Because of the inflammation, your airways also become twitchy, especially when exposed to smoke, dust, pollution or allergens. It is this twitchiness that causes your airways to constrict. This is a process called bronchospasm. And this is when you start getting short of breath and you may wheeze. And what do most people do? They wait for this to happen and then grab their albuterol inhaler. And yes, of course it works because it opens up the air passageways, but only for a short while. And here's the bigger problem. It only treats the spasm. It doesn't fix the root issue, the inflammation, which is why your symptoms keep coming back over and over. To fix asthma, you need inhalers that contain steroids. They calm the inflammation from the inside. So don't just treat the twitch, remove the itch. Talk to your doctor and get the right inhaler.